Hi guys, how are you? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Anna. For those of you who just tuned in, welcome. Today I have for you my monthly uh, decorating sheets for March. So this month it's this kit here. I love this. This is like so me. I love florals. And it's so pretty with the hummingbirds. Really, really love it. Um, I am a Latina, so I do not celebrate uh, St. Patrick's Day. I'm not Irish, and I really don't like beer. So, yeah, I wanted to get a kit that resembles more me, like florals and stuff like that. My phone is going crazy over there. So, excuse that. So, I figured I seen this kit, and I fell in love with I am going to show you what's consists in her kits she has three pages for her monthly and this is the Erin Condren size but it will fit for the recollection coil which what I have here if I didn't mention earlier so you get three sheets like I said the first one is your top banners with the days of the week your extra um, sheet to cover up any of February's days are on here and you get a full box here which you could either use it for anywhere else or just to cover up the first day of april her second sheet here you get some more full boxes one that's dedicated for saint patrick's day you get payday flags you get your sidebar um stackables the days of the week the dates the date dots which they're not dots they're squares you get some page flags dots here and you get your icons and the third sheet, you get more flags, teardrops, you get the holidays here, which is Ash Wednesday, Spring Forward, Spring is here, and Pi Day. For those of you who don't know what Pi Day is, Pi Day is more of a celebration for mathematics, and that is usually on March 14th. So then you get some bildus here, more than enough, I tell you that much, because there's two, four, six, eight bildus here, and you also get some quarter boxes and in the bottom you get some washi strips that's cut thin for vacation or days to block off so for me this is a more than enough to do my monthly spread so since the recollection coil planner does have this color here which is fine with me because it's green it consists with the month but the kits are not that I've used so far are not wide enough to cover the whole thing on top of there. So this month I'm going to do almost the same, but not sticker paper. I'm going to use copy paper that I cut up and I'm going to block it off like so. Use some Elmer's glue and it should be good to go. And also what I have here are my own icons that I designed and cut yesterday. I actually did a whole sheet of these so that I have enough for eight months. These are the bills that I really need to keep track of and I've noticed in mostly all of the shops, not just Tetmouth Crafts, but all of the shops really don't give you the icons that you need. Well, the ones that I use, that is, the ones that I have purchased from, doesn't really come with the icons that you really need for the month. So I decided to make my own, but the owner of Temple Crafts got back to me and she said that moving forward, I think after April, that she will start including these um, icons. So I'm looking forward to that. So yeah, as for now, I'm going to use these. So let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing I want to do is flip this over here upside down so that I could put these strips here. So I am going to just take this glue stick and just put the glue on the planner and then take this, line it up. It doesn't have to be perfect underneath here if I leave some behind. Excuse my phone. That is my daughter texting me. Um, as long as the top is covered. That's all that I would need. Just the top to cover all the greens. So let's do the same on this side. So I'm not sure if all of you have seen my blog, my blog, my vlog that I did for Friday 
um, about my health issues, basically my arthritis for the surgery. I am now going through some shoulder issues on my right arm, arm, shoulder, I swear, I know how to talk people, <laughs> I really do. Um, I had my arm in a sling all weekend long, today is Monday. All weekend long, in order for me to be able to do this plan with me, because my arm, basically my shoulder, not my arm, keep saying my arm. So my doctor basically thinks that I tore my rotary cap, which was suck because I am so tired of going through so many issues. But what can I do? And I definitely cut that wrong. So, yeah, I am definitely going to try my hardest to make sure that I can do my plan with me and everything else on my channel, regardless of my shoulder pain, unless I go through surgery, and that's going to be a whole different issue, because I will be um, with my arm in a sling for six weeks. Okay, so that is down, and now we could go ahead and proceed with covering up the top. So, put that away. Last time this was together, and it's exactly like the February monthly. Some shop separates these two from each other, but she actually has it as one giant sticker. It's easier to handle. That is that. So now let's go ahead and do the other side. So now all I have is that full box there on that sheet. Let's look. How's it going so far? Ah, oh, I already love it. Love it. I just had this one left and I think I'm going to take it for down here. Or should I put, I'm going to put this one because it match more of this scenery. That looks so freaking cute. Now, what I want to do, or should I say what I don't want to do is put these date squares. They're green, but there is green in here as well. So I really don't need to cover them up. So what I want to do is put one of these. This is the Create 365 Mombi Happy Planner um, stickers. And these are more of quotes. One would really fit in here really nicely. And it doesn't matter if some of the green show because, again, so are the dates. Like, I really like this one. And it is pink, so it will match. It says, every day may not be good, but there's good in every day. I like this, so I think I'm going to use this. So, what I want to do first is put the three boxes that I want, and I'm going to... I think I'm going to start off with the green one. Perfect. I really like that. I like to incorporate other stickers. And I definitely want to have a quote for the month. So this is how she looks so far. Loving it. I'm going to put down a vacation strip because my daughter has spring break this whole week here. And we decided to go down to visit her fiance. So we're gonna leave on the 10th. Before I forget, this is spring forward. You know what? I'm doing it and you can even see me. Yeah. Come on Anna. Get with the get with the program. There that is and then the 20th 
spring begins. Who out there cannot wait for spring? Let me tell you, I'm not a spring person. My favorite season is fall because of all, you know, the cute sweaters, boots, and all that. I love the fall because I'm always hot, so fall is really good. Plus, like I said, the styles, the makeup, it's so much better. But I'm actually looking forward for spring because I want to do a butterfly garden in the side of my house, the front yard, and... I'm just so excited to try to get that done this year. I want to do it last year, but I never got around to it. But this year, I'm definitely going to do it. Okay, and then the 14 here is Pi Day. There we go. Okay, and now for Ash Wednesday, which is the first. Okay, there we go. And I hope my noggin was not in frame. <laughs> so let's take a peek of how she's coming along. Yeah, it's looking so nice. So I'm going to put this for YouTube Instagram and my weight loss. Did I do that last month? No, movies. So I think I'll put the movies up here, YouTube and Instagram here. Because what I started doing is writing down the movies that I want to watch for that month. Not necessarily that it came out on that month, but the movies that I want to watch on that month. Because I love watching movies. Have a birthday cake. I need to get my birthday balloons. Okay. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Let's go ahead. You know what? Before I actually put her birthday, I forgot to put St. Patrick's Day. And it's here. And my son is home from school. Hey, buddy. How was school? Good. Good? Mm -hmm. Love you. Love you too. Yep, that's my baby. March 29th is my oldest daughter's birthday. So I am going to use this purple here, quarter box. And put it here which funny story do a little story time my son's birthday was on the 22nd of February originally my um, due date was for March 22nd okay and when she was younger she's like I didn't want to share that's my birthday month I don't want to share and I told her you know it's okay Desiree um, he won't have your month for his birthday month and I said that because all of my kids all three of them were preemie a month to the day of the due date always so I said even to my doctor March 22nd I will have him February 22nd and that's exactly what happened same thing with my youngest daughter it's September 11th and her original due date was for October 11th. Yeah. And Desiree was supposed to be um, April 27th. But I had her March 29th. Yeah. So when it came for due dates, I didn't really put mine to my actual due date. Because I knew I was going to give birth a month before. And that's how it was. <laughs> so yeah, that was a quick story about birthdays so she was really really upset like i didn't want to share it's my birthday month and blah 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 uh, she was so cute so cute when she said that all concerned about her birthday month okay so that is that so this is how she's turning out i am loving loving this so that was for the birthday now we'll go ahead and do day by day what i wanted to put was one of my cars on here because it's more like a road trip so 
We're leaving on the 10th. And we're coming home on the 18th. So I don't know if I should put on the car here or not. I don't know. I think I'm going to leave it like that for now. So let's just use, I'm going to put green. I'm going to put purple or pink. Oh, well, I'm just going to put this purple one here in between. Okay, that's that. And then the 10th is mine. I'm going to put, put some green. There's no green on this side. I'm going to lift this car up. I need to start using my tweezers because my ratchet nails, yes, ratchet, because they're looking very ratchet. It's messing things up. So that's fine if it covers it. I know it's from my phone. So let me see. I do have something on the first, which is a boxy charm. Now, I don't necessarily have to go in and pay for this. This is being pulled automatically, but I want to keep track of it. So, boxy charm is always pulled on the first. It's so freaking cute. And then. On the 11th, no, the 10th. The 10th is my Netflix bill. It's going to cover up the date, but it's fine. There it is. And then on the 11th is my light bill due. I think these stickers turned out so great. I'm so impressed with myself. I don't know if I could actually lay it down straight. There it goes. And then the 18 is my cable. Do. That's my daughter again. 22nd is my gas bill. I missed the insurance. It's on the 6th. My car insurance is on the 6th. And last but not least is my car note bill. And I like the fact that I left it blue because my car is blue. And that is the 28th. Well, see, I already used all of those. Sorry about that. I just got a call from the hospital and right on time. I have an appointment to do an MRI on my shoulder and I put it here on the 21st. So funny how she called exactly when I'm actually doing in my monthly planner, my monthly planning. And that is so damn crooked. Okay. So take my pen out. I'm actually using this paper mate ink joy. It's just a regular ballpoint pen. And I'm going to put here MRI at 11.15. 15 or 45? 15. I wanted to put this cake here for Desiree's birthday. And I think that is it. So now I am going to put down, and these don't really match. There's like a purple one. I could use a purple one. And I'm going to use a flag. I'm going to go on the 8th to get my nails done, these ratchetness done. But I want to do it then 
because I want to have fresh nails so when I go on vacay. So let's put a pink one, a pink flag. Put it here. And then take my tweezers and put that there. That's so cute. So as you can see, this doesn't really count because I cut that. Let me just put it in the garbage. This is what I have left the kit. I used everything from this first page. I have all these flags, teardrops, bill dues, and quarter boxes left. And here I have all the date squares, dots, icons, flags, one more sidebar tracker, I can't speak, and I want to use these two, I'm going to try to incorporate these two, or at least one, I want to put this one, I want to put this one here, just so that I could fill up some space. Yeah, that looks better to me. Okay, so this is what I have left. I could chop this page. And these two I'm going to keep with me in my folder here. This is last month. And I didn't really need to add anything. But I'm going to keep it in here anyway because I might just need these quarter box and flags and icon. So the same thing with these two sheets. So I think I'm going to fill out what I need to fill out with this okay so definitely let me know down below if you like how this turned out let me know as well what are your favorite monthly shops to use in your recollection coil not your Erin Condren so the ones who do have a recollection coil like myself please let me know what shops you like to use for your monthly so that way I could go ahead and check them out I will link Temp Love Crafts Etsy shop down below, so go ahead and check that out. And yeah, I really, really do love how this looks. It's so, so me. So if you like this video, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. It really does help my channel. And if you're not a subscriber, please go ahead and subscribe down below so you can be a part of my YouTube fam. And remember, I love each and every single one of you. And I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.